Welcome to the fourth episode of What Does Means Persuasions Architect at AWS. This week we're going to be talking about more about like the actual stuff I did in the week rather than talk about other concepts and you know sort of like last week's video where we deep dived with my manager to learn more about the role of the internship and AWS. So firstly I just want to say thank you to everyone that's reached out to me that's asked more about the role, asked more about AWS and more about the internship team. I'm just very happy to help answer any questions so just message me on LinkedIn in the comments down below. All right so this week it's been a bit of a fun week apart from like my uh, final project, which I'll do a video later on, uh, we got to take part in a hackathon. I know, a hackathon at AWS. In a hackathon, you basically have to build a solution to whatever the theme of that hackathon. The theme for this hackathon was that a customer uh, wanted to have to be able to basically track their order uh, in the whole delivery process. So we had to build that software for them. Anyway, so here's the hackathon video. And basically you've got until the end of today to build a MVP that will solve a customer's business problem. My pearl of wisdom is you can have the best tech in the world, you can create the best, and I call them minimal lovable products, but you've got to be able to present it. If you've got an hour to save the planet, you spend 59 minutes understanding the problem and one minute solving it. Good luck. So that's not how the hackathon actually looks like. I'll show you in this clip here. As you can see here, we're doing this thing called whiteboarding, which is where we draw out our diagram and our architect on how we're going to solve this problem. So we broke up the problem into lots of little steps. So we broke up the problem into the initial stage where, where it's at the warehouse, in transit, and when it's at the customers. And then you think about the problem and dive deeper into each one. So you can see in this clip that I'm literally trying to demonstrate our product and our service that we built by trying to put it into a real world problem. So uh, we start at the fulfillment center, the delivery driver goes in transit, and then it goes to the customer. And this little clip here shows the whole process. And uh, I think the managers really likes that. Best thing about a hackathon, you get pizzas, you get food usually. So make sure you turn up for that. So in, in your mind, like who would you put as the winner then? Um, I'm going with team one. And I think some, sometimes you've got to, uh, mostly because actually the demo's really got to work and that really matters. But I will, I will say that Team 2 had some really good strengths and there was a great one. I love the way you used the room and so I think uh, we'll talk to it a little bit more. Use the room uh, from uh, moving around and, and, and how you engage with the, with, with, uh, with the audience as well. So the presentation was really excellent. But overall I think uh, Team 1, because, it, because most of the demo worked or the demo worked, uh, then that was, uh, that was, uh, that's where my vote for me, the solution diagram for Team 2 was really well produced and really well spoken through and your presentation moving around the room just really captured my attention and drew me in. Um, so for me, my vote's going to go to Team 2. Alright, so, um, and so for me, I think Team 2, you may be bit off a little more than you could chew in today. So I love your think big scope. I love the way that you tried to demonstrate an end-to-end -end working solution, including you know, all of the stakeholders and all of the communications. Um, but you know, I lost a bit of confidence when, when, the, when the last bit of icing on the cake didn't quite work. Um, and so because of that, the winners are team one. Congratulations to Team One for winning. They all won £50 Amazon voucher each, so that's why you should take part in hackathons. It's pretty good for winning some prizes. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you in the next one.